What's up YouTube, this is Raz R. Ryan here today bringing a brand new episode on FIFA 17 Ultimate Team. So today I'm doing a play review on Gabriel Jesus. So this is the team that I'm using him. I've got him at striker with a marksman chemistry style on to boost his shooting, his dribbling and his physical. I've got Son at left wing, Sterling at right wing, Dembele, Torre, Fernandinho. Then I've got Luke Shaw, Zuma, but I do normally have Williams. Has got Williams red card in one of the games. You put him on. There we go. Then I got um, Bailey and El Mahandi, and then in net we've got Begovic. So Gabriel Jesus, he's a striker. He plays for Manchester City and is Brazilian. He is new signing for City. So his skill is a five star, which is crazy. It's, it's so good, and weak foot four star as well. And you can tell in the games. Um, he has a four star weak foot. He's really got to finish his left foot. Um, I'll show you guys some highlights soon of all his goals and his. He didn't get any assists. I was just trying to score goals with him, to be honest. But I bought him for 9,300. Um, he played three games from a club, which for every single player review I'd do, I'm going to play three games for each player so it's fair. And in them three games, Gabriel Jesus scored five goals. If you guys haven't watched the other episode, where did Diego Costa, he scored three goals in three, but he got an assist. Oh no, it's four goals in three, and he got an assist. So, Gabriel G did, did, did a bit better than him. So, guys, he's five foot nine, so you can't really expect him to win that many headers. And his work rate is high, high. And you can tell it's high, high, just because of he comes back quite a lot to come short for the ball. Like, he will run into midfield to come for the ball, which I kind of want... I play like him with pace and good dribbling. I want him to be on the back line, ready for the three ball, which is quite annoying that he comes back a lot. But, you know, you have to pass it around and try and work, or, and work around it. So, guys, I'll go into the highlights right now. Also, guys, before I go into that, here are his main stats. So, his acceleration is 84 and sprint speed 87, which is crazy good. His position is 82, his finishing is 82, his positioning... He sort of gets in the right place, but once again, like I said a minute ago, he just keeps going back into midfield for the ball, which doesn't make his position the best. Um, agility 90, balance 86, reactions 83, ball control 81, dribbling 85. Uh, he does keep hold of the ball quite a lot, and his balance is alright, but it's because he hasn't got that much. Uh, he's only got 56 strength, so his balance doesn't do too much when he's getting launched off the ball. And his stamina 98, and you can tell he's at 98 his stamina here. You can sprint with him all game, honestly. He was, he's a really good player for that. You don't have to use many fitness cards in him at all. And you can rely on him to bang one in the last few minutes because um, he's got so much stamina towards the end of the game. Like, towards the end of the first game, I scored a goal, which you guys see in the second. And he just managed to get behind all the defenders and just place it in, which it probably helps having um, so much stamina. So, guys, now I'm going to see all the highlights. So, here are the pros and cons of Gabriel Jesus. So, one of these pros is he's really fast. If you put a through ball on for him, he'll sprint. No centre-back will catch him up. He's too fast for any centre-backs. Depending how close he is to left-back and right-back, they might catch him up, but he should be um, fine on his own to run. Skill, he's got five star skill moves. If you know how to use a bit of skill and utilise his skill, then it's really easy for you to get past him. And the second goal, I think this might be it here, actually. Um, so I get the ball and do some nice skill just to get past the defender, here it is. Nice little flip flap past the defender and then bang it into the bottom corner. So I'm quite happy with that goal. Um, I use size of skill there, but um, on the other goals I don't really use size skill. I normally just try and use his pace. But either one works really. Um, he's shooting, I think he's shooting really good. Like the, the player review that I did before, the other day, it was Jay Costa. And I think he has better shooting than Jay Costa. Well, maybe not as much power, but his shooting is definitely better at, like, because um, his weak foot, I think that's pretty good as well. His left foot, the first goal that I showed you was with his left foot in the 80th minute to win the game, so he came up pretty big with his opposite foot. And his last pro is that he's cheap. He only costs 9k, but I think he's like 7k right now. Yeah, and he cost me 9k, but he's 7k. Unlike other players where you can spend a lot and you just don't get as much back, really. Right, so the cons is, is heading slash is small. Uh, if you get any corners or crossing, you can't really win too many headers. You won't get above the defenders. He will do it every now and again, but not really. Um, his strength as well, he, 
it's quite hard for him to push off some defenders. He will every now and again, but he doesn't do um, an awful lot. You know, I have to rely on his speed or his skill to get past his defenders. Then his positioning, his positioning isn't that bad, but it's just when he comes back because he's got high defensive work rate. He comes back in midfield, and I, I, I personally don't like that. You guys don't mind not like. Um, I like that where he comes back and helps you to pass the ball around. But I'm more of a person trying to get up to my wingers and strikers as fast as I can and pass it between them and try and do three balls. That's the way I play. I don't really play, pass it around too much. Right, so guys, overall, I give Gabriel G's 8.5 rating. Uh, I gave J. Costa 8 rating. I believe he's better than Costa. He's cheaper. The only thing he's really bad at, really, is his physical. And he's just his physical appearance that's what it is it's like his strength his jumping his heading anything like that is just not too good but guys hope you did enjoy the video and subscribe if you haven't already make sure you like it as well if you did enjoy it look in the description down below from social medias make sure you follow me on them if you haven't as well go back and watch my other videos as well i've got one player review and i've got sbcs out so you guys might like watching them as well thanks for watching guys and peace